I'm the president and COO of PetFlow. Uh, that means that I manage both our operations part of the business, but also the rest of the org chart, including finance, marketing, strategy, and technology. PetFlow.com is a pure play e-commerce retailer that takes the hassle out of bringing pet food home from the store. Our operations center on three major touch points. First, customer service, where we're experiencing interactions with the customers uh, via text or via phone contact. Second, through our merchandising and sourcing operations, where we're deciding which products we want to carry and how much of them we want to stock. And third and finally is our distribution fulfillment operations, where we have two different distribution centers and a suite of other dropship and zone skipping uh, implementations in place that allow us to reach most of the country in two to three days by ground. It's the cost of shipping. We're shipping big heavy bags of pet food across the country and most of our customers aren't paying for shipping. Any cent we can squeeze out of that cost center has huge leverage for us in the way that we have profit to be able to get out of this business and so we need to do as much of that as possible. First, operationally, there were two big pieces. The first was getting really recent information so that we could have near real-time data from the time our invoices came through from FedEx in a form that was easy to digest. And the second was the basic blocking and tackling of making sure we had really strong, consistent, and high-quality claim submission. Those got knocked out remarkably quickly within a billing structure that made a ton of sense for us. The second big thing was the work that we did in collaboration with their contract negotiations group. Um, they have some of the best people in the industry in terms of understanding what's happening behind the curtain when you're talking to these folks with which, with which you have parcel relationships. And the outcomes we were able to effectuate with the partnership that we had with uh, their team around negotiations were really far beyond anything that we had expected at the onset. So we started working with Invista within the context of a parcel auditor relationship, and we've seen a number of these guys in our time. Uh, the technology that they have really set them apart. Uh, they obviously do an outstanding job chasing down the claims and making sure that they're all managed according to your agreements with your carriers, but in my opinion that's sort of table stakes. They do that great. What really separates them and differentiates them is how strong their web tools are. Their MyShip Info tool, which gives everybody in the organization access to really granular information or even some higher level information about our shipping costs creates actionable data so that whether it's the control suite or the operations team, my team's able to chase things down and make sure we understand exactly how much money we're putting toward that particular cost center so that things can be managed very quickly. And this is one of the few service providers we've worked with where there's a sales force that is empowered by the organization to be on top of client management and to bring about change. We've never gotten anything but a yes, we can take care of it answer. And there's always someone who can make something actionable happen very quickly. So we're never getting the run around hierarchically within their organization. Two, the technology is really top notch. For better or for worse, this whole business is about execution. And the execution is, is, is really second to none in our experience, having worked with a number of different parcel auditors. Um, and the final piece is that because Invista is so diversified and because of the partnerships they've had, the number of integrations they've done with really major players you've heard of and some smaller businesses as well, as new supply chain problems arise, you already have a trusted partner who understands your business, who you trust financially to come up with reasonable terms to be able to solve these new problems.